This is our distillation apparatus. On the left hand side we've got the entire apparatus and it's currently creating alcohol. On the right hand side we've got our fermentation jar. The fermentation jar contains a mixture of water, yeast, and sugar. During the week-long fermentation, the yeast have been consuming the sugar and producing alcohol and carbon dioxide. We want the alcohol to stay in the jar, but we don't want the carbon dioxide to stay in. It will build up and explode the jar. So therefore we have this airlock mechanism. This lets the carbon dioxide out and the lid keeps the alcohol from evaporating. The sugar wash is placed into this round borosilicate flask and that flask is then placed into a heating mantle. Rather than using a Bunsen burner, we use a heating mantle. It's simply a device that heats up the fluid in this flask. The sugar wash evaporates, travels through this tube into this device. This is called a gram condenser. Water flows through the tubes into the condenser, but does not mix with the condensed material because it's in a separate glass spiral inside the tube. The cool water then flows out while the gas that is turned into liquid drips down into this flask. Down here, we've got a flask that's starting to accumulate alcohol. 